Well, the past couple of days we've been fishing off of an area called the area known as Larson's Reef for the shark fin. And as usual, Larson's Reef for the shark fin can be a heartbreaker. What was really crazy is the change in the weather. You know, we had one day of flat calm, another day of southwest wind. Southwest wind came, sucked all the warm water off the west shore. Typical story, moved the fish around, changed the bite up. And today we had a north wind. And you know what? Probably the worst thing to hear from me after a tournament like this is I learned a lot. But you know, that's the great thing about fishing. That's the great thing about the outdoors is it's always changing and it's always evolving. And there's always something different going on. And I learned a lot. There's using offshore inline weights, the little guppies, and um, use the tadpoles a little bit. But you know, it was a situation where the fish were so high up in the water column and we needed consistency. I really wish I would have gone to snap guppies instead of inline guppies today. I think that might have changed up a little bit of the program and, and caught some more fish. And that's the one thing to realize when you're trolling crawler harnesses or trolling for walleyes is that a lot of times you need to change up stuff. Some days inline guppies will work the best. Some days snap guppies will work the best because what it does with a 50-50 snap weight system like you can read about on precision trolling, it'll actually take a act like a shock absorber and take that shock out of the, out of the line. So that instead of your spinner going through the water like this on an inline with a snap guppy or a snap weight, it'll actually do that number right there. But you know what? As far as the takeaways are concerned, had a great time, learned a lot. Absolutely, 100% proves once again that I'm wild for the outdoors, and I hope you are too. Thanks for watching.